Hi there, Jeremy Nagel from Nuanced IT here. In this video, I'm going to go through how to create custom views in Zoho CRM. Basically, what we're talking about here is being able to have multiple different views here that allow you to filter down very quickly on a subset of leads or accounts, or whatever module you're talking about. So I've got this custom view here, test leads, which only shows leads that have the word test in them. Let's look at how that was done. You can see I've got the criteria, last name contains test. The way I started was I went down here, so you click on the drop down, click on create view. I'll then choose a criterion. and I'll make it example is not empty. Then I can choose which fields I wanna have in there. You can hold shift down to select more than one and then choose who you wanna share it with, hit save. That'll then show you a subset. If you then want to perform further filtering, you've got filter leads by and you can choose the field and then you've got the same kind of ability here where you can filter based on certain criteria. There are other things that creating custom views opens up as well. I've got a blog post on this. In this blog post, I show how Rather than having to set up complex search records calls that use up your allocation very quickly, you can actually use get records in conjunction with a view, with a custom view. So if I wanted to get all of the records that fulfilled this criteria here, that example is not empty, in this case, it's not a huge benefit, but if you have multiple multiple criteria, then it is basically impossible to do that with search records. And keep in mind that you only get a small number of search records calls per day as well. So it's actually quite advantageous to do it this way. One thing to keep in mind is that when you do this, your record your custom view needs to start with the module name. So for me to make this one work, I need to actually call it leads arbitrary view. And if I'm doing it with a custom module, I need to use, let's see, where's the custom module? This one here, I need to use the module name like this custom module one test. Otherwise it won't work. Hope that helps.